a pleasant day. Oh, you're here. Hello, my fellow adventurers and my striker brothers. Uh, this is a promising day, isn't it? So in this video, I'll be discussing about the recent patch that I know all the strikers all over global had been waiting for. And the day my friend had finally arrived. So I will show you a side-by-side -side comparison first and we'll dive into the patch notes later. So, Gudere or was it? Tibore or Chidore? Anyways guys, enjoy this video after this bit. Hi, if you're new to my channel, please like and subscribe and click that notification bell to get updates on my new posts. This is the life man So guys, did you enjoy the movie? Me, I'm enjoying the sun and just getting my portrait done So let me check on the progress first Wait, uh, what the? Hey, that doesn't look like me <sighs> Anyway guys, let's go and check on the patch notes So here we are uh, in the library because there's no other place where to check the patch note but only here 
so come on in let's go okay so the patch note says here uh grandmasters attacks with quick skill combos while blocking the enemy's attacks but his continuous attack skills deals less damage relative to their casting time and these blocking skills are not utilized well in group combo combat uh, this is true because of the slow animation so it's more of a liability to use the, the skill so to address this issue we added endurance a new passive skill so endurance reduces the damage received while immobilized and using shoulder thrust twice will increase the damage dealt by the next skill used so i can see that with this new um new patch everyone's going to spam this skill because of this increased damage and if you read further it says here if shoulder thrust is used twice the skill used after will deal 20 percent more damage so 20 percent man it's really good because you want to use the shoulder thrust to pump your strongest skill which is uh, it's either gale force or your uh hell sweep so this is good news for us i mean this is a game changer because you want to figure out a new combo with this skill and man i'm excited and damn it's a lot of work but i've i've seen uh captain lucem his channel i've been following him he's done a lot of uh variation with the uh full force and then the shoulder thrust so you wanna you might wanna check it out guys because this guy is really good i mean he's the master of the grandmaster I mean badass striker out there so I'll put a link on my description below for you to uh, click I'll be releasing my own uh, combos too I'm still uh, lag on my other contents but I will I will uh, pub uh, publish a content for you guys uh, to bring some variation and strikers are combo based so the more combos you know the better and it's for you guys uh, to help the striker community and for you guys to improve on your skills so next moving on so um, moving on um, it says here we also change shoulder thrust to be immediately available while using other skills so that attacks could be blocked at any moment so I can see that uh, shoulder thrust will now be used as a canceling skills or an immediate utility whenever you need protection from attack so let's move on to the uh, skills themselves so first is knee hammer decrease the time it takes to use another skill after flow ravenous is used and increase the skills and pbe pvp and pbe damage so um as you can see in my video a side by side comparison video nothing has changed in the speed of this skill but rather on the fluidity of the next skill but in my own humble opinion i want this skill to be quicker and the distance to be longer because uh, most of the strikers would agree with, with me on this that we use this skill as a engage or a chase or a gap closer and also an ex escape skill so we want to get out of a tight switch situation quickly and with protection so but it's okay if i hope the developers could improve on the skill uh, in the future so that is just my opinion moving on next uh, shoulder thrust we have been discussing this so improve the skill to allow using shoulder thrust right after using another skill Improve the skill to allow quicker use of low whirlwind kicks. So usually I don't use this whirlwind kick kicks because this is really slow. <laughs> I turn it off. But now if you can see on the side by side uh, video I've shown you earlier. 
the transition from the shoulder thrust to these kicks is much faster but i won't be using it in battlefield of the sun in arena yes bex is added a super armor applied to the back not applied in arena effect on the skill so but in my own humble opinion i mean why not convert this uh, skill into a full guard i mean you're protected all over your uh, body so that's just my opinion okay next disrespect improve this respect so that you can use other skills faster using the skill okay next chip shot increase the attack speed of the skill improve the skill for a quicker use of the flow in energy blast so it's the like hadouken thing as you can see in my video comparison nothing much has changed in this skill and i'm like disappointed is for style points this is a really good skill but i can't use it in a combo because it's too st still too slow i mean for pbe still too slow so i hope uh, uh bdm or black desert mobile improve this skill because this for me this is good and let's see in the future okay next full four decrease the skill number of attacks to simplify the action modify days on second hit to days on hit in line of the second changes so increase skill fi skills final attack hits and increase attack range in line with the changes to skill action so i'm a fan of this full force i think uh, this is good this is good that they've changed skill on the improvement you will see that it's more like a mini gale force to it added to it uh, i might i will uh, i will create a new video for the skills so to test these skills but i've seen this one on the full force it has an added range to added to it so this is good increase the time available for changing attack direction when using skill okay increase the skill pbe and pbb damage okay so health sweep increase the attack range for the last hit to also include behind the character and increase the attack range for uh gene energy blast to include the character itself so what this means is that the sweeping kick will receive a more like an aoe so i, I think it's limited to this to the range of the skill so it only at, it also attacks your 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 back or the enemies behind you and then the gene blast or the hadouken thing will have a attack range so i'm i will test this one if how long is the uh, range for this one okay next okay next is energy vac increase the skills pve and pvp damage okay next gale force increase the skills pve and pvp damage this is really good from 650 percent to 715 on pve but on pvp it's 413 it's big oh it's big okay it's good rising uppercut increase the skills pb and pvp damage but this is a good skill but too slow if you're a fan of street fighter you know you like this one so please pearl abyss please buff this one this is a really good skill for style points okay next uh okay that's the last so that's it guys that ends our patch review just finish eating pasta and ham burger i know a lot of you guys uh, not only the strikers but all the other classes who received the buff are celebrating right now so i'm with one with you in celebrating by the way i kept mentioning style points and i might get you guys confused there is no such thing in black desert mobile i just uh, referenced it from dmc or the devil may cry game and if you're watching this and you're new to my channel please subscribe because in this channel i upload guides not only for the striker class but also about tips and tricks about the game and be sure to be updated on my post by clicking that notification button and this channel is also about bringing fun in the game so with all that being said this is solid striker just a gamer for fun saying rock on solid strikers and i'll see you on the next video
I just finished eating spaghetti. I just finished. Uh, I just finished eating spaghetti and carbonara. What? I just finished eating. Um, I'm getting hungry. Yeah. 